Hey guys, how are you doing today? Our today's session is about LinkedIn advertisement. Now most of us today have been using LinkedIn for our professional reasons. It's either for creating a profile for ourselves, it's either for uh, applying for jobs because LinkedIn today is one of the best portal for applying for jobs. So in one of my videos in the past where I talk about how do we polish our LinkedIn profile, in today's session I talk about how do we run advertisements on LinkedIn and what do we require to create great advertisement on LinkedIn. When you are on LinkedIn, you actually have to understand there are two things. You have a LinkedIn profile, so what you see right now is your LinkedIn profile where you can send friends requests to people, you can connect with them, you can apply for a job using this, you can polish your LinkedIn profile so that you come on top when people search for digital marketers or, or profession of your choice. You try to polish your LinkedIn profile so that you become a credible person in the industry and you are in a position to connect with a lot more. But what is in it? that you require to create LinkedIn advertisements. Now, you need to at least have a company page. Now, this is my company page, which is called EchoMe. You need to have a company page, like how on Facebook you need to have a profile and a Facebook business page to run advertisements. On LinkedIn, you need to have a profile and a LinkedIn business page for running advertisements. Now, creating company pages on LinkedIn is not going to take much time. You, to register your LinkedIn company page, you have to log on to linkedin.com slash company iPhone beta slash setup slash new slash and you get to see this particular page. This is where you register your company name. This is where you register your company's URL. Let's say if my company's name is Ecomi, I write down the URL as call me again and I have to verify and I have to create page but remember for creating a LinkedIn company page you need to have your professional email ID registered with your LinkedIn profile which means you need to have your secondary email ID or your primary email ID as your company email ID so if I am having sort of at gmail.com then LinkedIn will not register a company page. But if I have sort of at ecomi.in registered with my LinkedIn profile, I can then be in a position to create a company page out there. Now, I believe most of you who are watching this video already have a LinkedIn company page. If not, please create a LinkedIn company page before you get started. So now let's get to understand the basics of LinkedIn advertisements. To get started with LinkedIn advertisements, you have to log on to linkedin.com slash ads. It will redirect you to this page. Now this page is very essential for you to actually understand how LinkedIn advertisement works or what kind of solutions does LinkedIn offer. Now when you move your cursor to this destination, which says advertising, it shows you various products it has. Now, under the products category, they have sponsored content, they have sponsored in mail, they have text ads, dynamics ads, and programmatic display ads. Now, sponsored content is nothing but boosting a post, like how you on Facebook you upload a particular content on your page and you boost it in order to make it reach out to the news feed of your target audience. Similarly, here you will notice that when you boost your post or when you sponsor your content, you make your content, be it video, be it link, be it just a text, be it just an image, you can make it reached out to your target audience on their timelines. Sponsor in mail is nothing but an email which you introduce on LinkedIn under the messages section of a profile of your target audience. So instead of going on the news feed you basically create sponsored in mails like how we create gmail ads on google we need to create linkedin in mail ads now linkedin in mail ads are really effective why because you reach out to inbox of people 
and you buy your time you make them open that email and you make them find your messages out there in their inbox so this is an effective way of advertising on linkedin remember linkedin advertisements are more expensive when compared to your facebook and twitter advertisements uh, it's because you can actually reach out to the CXOs or um, the senior management of an organization. If that's your target audience, LinkedIn is the right place for you to be. Now you have text ads on LinkedIn. Now these text ads on LinkedIn, you usually observe these text ads on LinkedIn on the right hand side. So when you are on LinkedIn.com, what you see here on the top is a LinkedIn text ad. So you see your LinkedIn text ad on the top. You usually see your LinkedIn text ad on the right hand side. Now LinkedIn text ad is almost like a Facebook display advertisement on the right hand side. But just that you do not have a choice of creating uh, amazing pictures. You do not have a choice of doing a lot more justification to the content that you could add in these advertisements. So there is very lot of limitations with these text ads. And in my journey in the past, I have not seen this performing uh, great for us. So I have used products of LinkedIn for clients like uh, um, origin learning I have used products uh, of LinkedIn for clients like Bosch India and what I have experienced here that sponsored content works brilliantly because you go with an image you go with a lot of text and you try to convince the audience with your communication well text ads does not do great justification LinkedIn also introduced dynamic ads and programmatic display ads where you can buy these spaces in auction dynamic ads are nothing but these ads that you see on the right hand side of linkedin so this particular feature that you see now this what you see on the right hand side here is an example of a dynamic advertisement it's nothing but a display advertisement now this is directly not in your control you cannot run your ads directly here you have to buy these ads from people who are reselling them or you can directly talk to LinkedIn offices. Your country might have a LinkedIn office like we have LinkedIn India office and we can talk to them and try to buy the space out there or try to understand who is a reseller from where you can buy this in auction. Now that's about LinkedIn advertisements. So how do we get started? Today we are going to create a LinkedIn lead generation advertisement. For that to happen, you have to log on to linkedin.com slash ad slash accounts. So before you get started with your LinkedIn advertisement, you have to click on tools and click on lead forms. Now this is a form that I am building for my lead generation advertisement on LinkedIn. So you have to now click on create a new form template. So my offer here is free digital marketing course. Register to avail. Give your form a name because that's very important for you to save this particular form. So now my lead generation form is all saved. I have to move on to the next level. I have to now run a LinkedIn advertisement. So I'm creating a campaign right now. I'm picking up a sponsored content campaign. Now in this, like any other advertisement campaigns online, you have to give this a campaign name, be it on Google, be it on Facebook, be it on Twitter, be it on LinkedIn. Now I'm, I'm going to give a campaign name right, right here, sort of free course 
and my idea here is to collect leads using LinkedIn lead generation form. So there are two options here, send people to your website or content. If you have a landing page or if you want to drive traffic to your website, you might want to opt for this option. But now I'm going to pick up the second one because my idea is to immediately collect leads from LinkedIn by making people just click on the sign up button and directly reach to lead generation form and submit their details out there instead of driving them to a particular landing page and making them spend time there and making them fill the details i am cutting short time by making it a lot more easier for people to subscribe to my free course so i collect lead generation using linkedin generation forms and click on next so you must be wondering how did i get these content here I have not done anything great. I just have posted a status on my LinkedIn company page and whatever I post here on my LinkedIn company page, it starts appearing here. You can even click on create a new sponsored content right from here and run your advertisements so now i'm going to run advertisement with this particular post so this is how the advertisement looks on your desktop this is how the advertisement looks on mobile phone so now I'm going to run advertisement using this particular post that I have made on my company page. So I've picked up this. So I'm going to now click on sponsor selected because I'm going to run advertisement with this. I can choose up the button that I want to show at the bottom of the ad. So I have options like sign up, apply now, download, get quote, learn more, subscribe, register. So I'm going to pick up subscribe or even sign up is better I have to pick up the form the free course lead generation form which we have built using the tools section of the LinkedIn campaign manager so I'm all set now I have to move on to next destination I have to now decide who do I want to reach out to now Something very important for all of us to know in LinkedIn advertisement is that LinkedIn is one such platform where you can reach out to people on the basis of their job titles, on the basis of the industry that they work, on the basis of company. Now, what is very good about this? When compared to Facebook, LinkedIn is the place where people update their job title so while you are running your advertisements on facebook you can target people with the job title out there but they're very limited there are very few people who actually update their job titles on facebook but on linkedin you cannot ignore this particular aspect so what do we do next i decide on who do i want to reach out to I can now target people on the basis of the company name, so employees of a particular company, company's industry, company size, job title, job function, job seniority, member of a particular school, field of study, degrees that people have taken, the skill sets people have, if they are a particular member of a group or if they are a member of a particular group, gender age years of experience what we do not have here is advanced targeting like facebook in terms of marital status in terms of parenting status in terms of hobbies or interest in terms of mobile phones uh, so you can't do all that here at this point of time why is linkedin very important if you're trying to target the ceo the cmo the cto the cfo the managers, the vice presidents, the key decision makers, you will see them spending more time on LinkedIn than on Facebook. So it's best that you reach out to people on LinkedIn using this platform. 
if you are aiming to recruit people linkedin is the right platform for you to advertise if you're trying to sell services in a b2b domain which means you're trying to sell a product uh, a technology product you're trying to sell an insurance service linkedin is the right place because linkedin is where people sit down with more seriousness when compared to platforms like facebook so if you're trying to be cool you have products which are cooler you might want to be on facebook but if you're trying to be serious if you are trying to communicate something very important you have a serious technology product you have a serious insurance or financial product then linkedin is the right place for you to be so now i pick up a particular country let's say i want to target country like india on the basis of job title i want to target all the people who are into marketing marketing manager because i'm trying to sell a digital marketing course to them marketing executive sales marketing manager director of sales marketing linkedin shows that i have about 2 lakh 80000 plus people who are either marketing managers marketing executives sales marketing manager director of sales marketing brand consultants public relations guys people in the current role or people in the current or past role under this category so i have picked up current and past and it shows about 4 lakh plus people are or where doing something to do with marketing so i proceed further i am not keeping any limitation on the gender i am not keeping any limitation on the age so i'm just going ahead and running my advertisement out there so as you proceed you have two more options that linkedin offers you to pick up from deliver campaigns to linkedin.com and the partner sites so you can choose that app you can pick up on an option where linkedin allows or ask you to allow them to do an audience expansion so they try to figure out similar audience and run advertisements for that so if you are very precise and if you want to only reach out to the target audience that you have picked then you should opt out of this but if you're okay and you will want linkedin to test further audience out there then you might want to opt for it this is done i move on to the next section now this is where i need to decide what am i supposed to pay to linkedin out there i have various options to pick from one i can run a cost per click campaign or i can run cost per impressions i believe very soon we'll also get to see cost per lead because this is a lead generation form that we are running so i'm sure linkedin is innovating there so let's believe i am picking up cost per click and i am picking up my daily budget as 500 rupees now if you notice the minimum bid that linkedin wants us to spend per click is about 140 rupees which is much 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 larger than your facebook advertisement a little lesser a little more than twitter advertisements now something to learn about this is linkedin is an expensive affair unlike facebook for in facebook i am getting leads for 3 cents 5 cents and 8 cents but on linkedin i will not get a lead for less than 2 dollars so 1 to 2 dollars at least now i am going to start this campaign immediately so this is just for your trial this is just for your understanding how to run a linkedin lead generation advertisement i am going to launch the campaign but that's about it may you have any questions please feel free to add in the comment section below thank you so much have a great day and i hope you have subscribed to my youtube channel please 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 subscribe to my youtube channel and also connect with me on facebook by logging on to facebook.com/saurav jain digital thank you have a great day